Tizzle every now and then. Tizzle? Like, yeah, weird one. Uh, Rian, he got one from when we were both at Swansea alone. Can't really remember it, you know. He's always seems to be getting mixed, so. Just a beast, an animal, a myth. <laughs> First time someone asked you for your autograph? I must have been maybe 15, maybe at one of the Chelsea games. Actually, no, like, when we went on tour um, as younger players to like tournaments and that in other countries, yeah. like in Belgium and stuff like that. Yeah. I was young, I must have been like 11 or something like that. Someone asked me for my autograph, just a little scribble or whatever. Yeah. How about you? Saying that, there was, uh, we went to a Hong Kong tournament um, a few seasons ago, and over there they were a bit mad, like the fans, the fans <laughs> were a bit mad, so they got anyone to, they wouldn't even care who you are, but they'd get you to sign something. So probably over there, just a scribble. I didn't even have an autograph then. Nice. Last person that you meg. Conor Gallagher. Training at Palace, we always try to make each other. Currently, I'm winning. I make them last, so he's still got to get me now. But last person I met was Connor. What are you? Not make them anyone in a while, you know. <laughs> That's actually quite depressing when I try to think about it now. I'll just throw him under the bus. Hands with Chowder here, he'll probably be one. <laughs> um, training in Leicester, obviously, just little Rondo. And he's always seems to be getting mixed, so it'd probably be him. First football hero. <sighs> Obviously, watching the Premier League, it'd probably have to be Thierry Henry. Uh, watching him on TV, obviously, he had all the qualities that he'd, he'd want as a player. He was rapid and he just scored goals. And when you're young, all you want to do is score goals. You ain't really bothered about the defending side and stuff like that. <laughs> yeah. so. Mine was Didier Drogba. Yeah. Um, family from the Ivory Coast. I was born there. Yeah. Um, he's obviously from the Ivory Coast as well. And then he played for Chelsea and stuff like that. And he was. Just a beast, an animal. So every time I saw him play, for me, it was just amazing seeing him. Yeah, it was. That Champions League final, mate. <laughs> Mad, man. Last song you played? Probably going to be in Adele's new one, you know. Is it? Have you heard Adele album? Yeah, I, haven't yeah. heard, I haven't heard the album now. That voice is just good. That's the only reason I've been listening to it, to be fair. And it's quite clicky, if you know what I mean. Just start getting used to the words more and more and listening to it quite a bit, to be fair. Rema, woman. Good Afro beat, good tune. I like it a lot. I like Rama. Um, yeah. Nice little beat to it. You can obviously get a little bop to it every now and then, isn't it? So, best dance out of us. So. Definitely not me. I can't dance. No, I'm not good. I'm not good. I'd... Yeah, but you'll have that little. Anything. A little bit, just a bit. Yeah, but exactly, no, I'm, yeah. Not, I'm not good. I'm I haven't not... got that. Yeah, I think I'm not good. Nah. Not for me dancing. <laughs> I'd rather sing. I'd rather sing. Go on. No. <laughs> <laughs> Must be mad. First England kit that you remember? I don't know, you know. It's a difficult one, that. For me, it'd be the 2010 World Cup where Lampard against Germany. Obviously, it was miles over the line, but <laughs> no one saw that. <laughs> no um, VAR back then, innit? But it was like a white and blue Umbro kit that I had when I was younger. I think my one was, I can't remember the exact one, but I think I remember Joe Cole scoring against Sweden. A ridiculous scarf. Is it all? Is it all red? The kit in red. Was it red? I remember that one. Yeah. An outrageous goal. I remember that. Um, I remember yeah. that red kit. Yeah. Nice kit, that actually. Yeah, the ones I've won Reese. I think not too long ago was. Um, I think it was all white and it had the, the baby blue on the side. That one was really nice. I just really yeah. like the design of that. Fitted well. Yeah. yeah, I like that one. Last Instagram post. I don't have Insta. So, right, yeah. this is all you, mate. For me, it'll be the game the other day, to be fair. What's the catch? Important win. Important win last night, that was it. Czech Republic were top of the top of the table at the time, and they'd been unbeaten, I think. Uh, they'd won four out of four so far, and it was important to go there and beat them so we can be still in with a chance to top the group. First picture in your camera roll. It was an England kit. Yeah, uh, look. <laughs> this was, I don't know when this was, it says 2016, me in an England kit, which is ironic, I guess. Can't really remember it, you know, but it was, I was wearing number two, so I was playing right back back then, which means I was a little faster than I was now. Um, could run a bit more as well. 
But yeah, obviously it was a proud moment. Under 17s or something like that. Under 17s or yeah. If it's 2000s, yeah, it must have been under 17s, I'm guessing, yeah. Last person that you texted. There it is. Uh, <laughs> my, definitely my missus, probably 100%. Mine's Jenny. Is it? Yeah, player liaison. My, my, uh, my phone wasn't working. So I've got two phones, so I asked her to put the my other phone into the into the, the group chat. Oh, okay. yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. I've seen you get added. Yeah. Yeah everyone, was, yeah, everyone thought it was a new player or something, but... Yeah, mine wasn't my missus in the end. It was one of my mates uh, outside of football, but he was just asking me to go on COD. Uh, I, had to, I had to come to do media, so obviously I'll go on after. First nickname. My name is Marks. So easy, Marky. Along the years, it's developed Marco. Um, then my initials, MG. So I've had a few, but uh, Marky's the first one. I think my favourite one's Marco. I like that a lot. Right. Well, my dad gave me Lukey all the time when I was younger, and that. Uh, just I don't know why they extend the nickname. It doesn't make sense, does it? But, <laughs> and then as I've grown up, I've had a few Tizzle every now and then. Tizzle. I, yeah, weird one. Don't know where that came from. Anyway, I'm gonna start calling you that. You know? My mates, <laughs> my mates still call it me to this day. Like I always get called Tizzle when I go. Go out of them or whatever. So that's a new that's, one. Yeah. I'm gonna start calling you that one. <laughs> you won't like me saying it, but uh, Rian, he got one from when we were both at Swansea on loan. Um, Brewy, I thought he doesn't like it, <laughs> but I'm gonna say it on camera, Brewy. <laughs> so <laughs> Brewy, if anyone sees Rian, start calling him Brewy from now. That's mad. That's a mad <laughs> one. I wouldn't be happy with that either. Last time you googled yourself, mine would have been the other night then. Uh, obviously, <laughs> to get pictures, <laughs> trying to find the best photos to post on Instagram, but that would have been my last time I Googled myself, I suppose. Maybe after a sign for Palace? Yeah, yeah just to see if there was anything said. Yeah. Yeah, just checking if I was trending or anything. <laughs> yeah, but, yeah so, that was always yeah, yeah. every now and then, I suppose. I think it's good. Yeah, just, I do. Just yeah. once in a while, just to see if anything's yeah. changed or anything. I don't know. <laughs> yeah. I don't know. Anyone's but, yeah. thoughts or whatever. Yeah. First impression of Ashley Cole. He's one of them. He's just down with the lads still. I think he's still got that young, young, young age in him, any so always around. There's always having a laugh with us, and that's the main thing I think he's really about is having a laugh and banter and stuff. Yeah, same. Um, doesn't take himself too seriously. No. I mean, on the pitch, that's when it really yeah. the work starts. But when you see him around, he's it's nice cool. guy. He's always joking and laughing with everyone. Um, yeah. Just like you said, so. Yeah, really top guy. And obviously great to learn from is with how many England caps and that he's had up with, uh, over the years. So yeah, he's a great guy to have around. Yeah. But, yeah. Last one, yeah. Yeah. Last player you swap shirts with. Oh. I've not swapped shirts. I don't really swap shirts too often, but the last time I would have done it was last camp, I think. It was with one of the Slovenia players. So that would have been the last time I swapped a shirt, I suppose. Uh, last game in the Prem against Wolves, mine was Connor Cody. I just had a chat with him saying, telling him that like, he's done quite a bit for me. Because I, I, think, I think it was a few years ago when I was under 16s or something. He wrote a letter when he was playing to so like the, the next captain, which was me at the time when I was playing, just saying good luck in that. And then obviously I've We've read, um, read that letter and it's obviously helped me get to where I am in there. So I just mentioned it to him and we had a nice chat after and yeah. we just swapped, swapped shirts after the game, which was nice.